Today for Mousetrap Monday, I'm excited to show you two of my newest Mousetrap Monday staff members. If you've followed my channel for a while now, you know I review mouse traps and the live catch traps I test out with my pet mice. I went down to the pet store and got a white, black, brown, and silver mouse. I photographed them for the thumbnails and they're a really important part of my YouTube channel. Well, I was looking online and I didn't know it, but there are people who are serious about raising mice. They breed them for specific traits, they take them to shows, and there's a huge variety. There's mice that are hairless, mice with long hair, all different color combinations. It's really fun. As I was looking through the different colors of fancy mice, two that I thought were really cool was one called a chinchilla and one called a black fox, and that's what we have here. One thing that I think is so cool about these mice is they came with a pedigree list, so I know their family tree. And the parents of these mice were actually born in England. They were bred by a lady named Sarah Cudbill. And then those mice were flown over to the US and I looked online and found a Facebook page here in Oregon that raises them. It was a seven hour car ride for me to go pick them up, but fortunately the owner said they bring them over. They were flying by in a small plane. So we went and picked these up at a small airport. Now I'm not gonna be breeding these mice for shows. I just want a little color variation in the Mousetrap Monday staff. If you wanna learn more about this breed and the genetics, I'll put a link in the description below. But I am gonna be breeding these with my white, black, and brown mice. So I'm curious what traits will come through. Really fancy pedigree mice with common pet store mice. Now, like I said, this is called a chinchilla and this is called a black fox. So help me name these two, they're bucks, they're both males. The males tend to be more friendly and you'll be seeing these and their kids in future videos. So leave a comment down below of what we should name our chinchilla and our black fox mouse.